Jeff Stewart O'Keefe. Welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. Thank you for having me so much. Um, great. So, what are we going to make? So, today we're making some Thanksgiving favorites. And um, we're going to start off with bread pudding. So, milk, cream, there's white sugar, brown sugar. Uh, five sugar, eggs, vanilla. Uh, oh, I forgot my vanilla. vanilla there. Cream and, and milk. Right? I love bread pudding, and I know you can make it low fat, but cream is, you got to I mean, it's bread Thanksgiving. Bread. Oh, no. Does anybody way. here make low fat at Thanksgiving? The no. Scrooge <laughs> does. Stewart is a wonderful chef who will have so many ideas that Christine can apply in the kitchen that will make her life easier every day and all week. So basically, Christine is like, has all these new things happening. She's going back to work. She has a new baby. She wants to spend more time with her kids. So I'm gonna give her some recipes that have multiple uses. So we just put it over right beside the food processor here. I definitely feel with showing Christine these recipes today, I can almost say like empowered her to get back into the kitchen. So let me give it a good smash. I'm just going to get some salt here and just some nice coarse salt will get you a finer paste. Now it's so vital in getting the right measurements every time when you're baking with any recipe. Follow the recipe, measure it out properly and you will never ever go wrong. Good luck, okay? The steak is really good. Mm. I think the winner on this plate is like the steak and the butter and yeah. the blue cheese butter. What were the issues with their team? With the potatoes, I found there was something that overpowered them. It was a lot of truffle oil. The asparagus was, was kind of undercooked, it was a bit crunchy for me. The best thing about the smart steamer, very low energy, there's no cleanup, and it's fast and it's healthy. Anyone can do it, it's easy, come on, like three pieces. And it's perfection, if you have this, you don't need a husband, you don't need anything, that's all you need in your life. You see? No, I you know, smoked salmon is such a traditional Irish dish and it's so flavorful already. And I just basically use the flavors like, you know, from a scallion, onion, and I would roll it in black sesame seeds. Then I saw that spray that we had. So I just gave it like a quick like sheen of the silver spray and it meant all the difference. It just like popped immediately. Actually celebrating St. Patrick's Day with some Irish cooking. We're saying welcome to Stuart O'Keefe. I love that. Okay, this I love. Beer and milkshakes. Okay, just for today. So we have like two scoops of ice cream. And I've never heard of the idea of beer and chocolate right. and uh, ice cream mixed and together. Of course, Guinness. I guess yeah. you, so do this like a hat. you put beer in your milkshakes often? <laughs> when alcohol is involved, it's always fun. Amen yeah. to that. Amen to that. You know, I've always been looking for that platform where I can showcase these fantastic recipes I come up with. It's kind of sad where I can't show them anywhere, but I finally found Appetites, this great platform where it shows you step by step how to make all my recipes. 